Hello and welcome to my channel. This is my second video. My name is Michelle. My channel will be for locks, lock care, locks, period. Um, like, subscribe so that you can get all the alerts when I put up a new video. I will be trying to upload videos every like twice a week or so. Um, I just washed my hair. Freshly washed. Um, I palm rolled it the last time that I normally in a lock. Um, like I said before, um, I'm palm rolling temporarily until my shoulder gets in the bed. It feels better enough for me to go 10, ten hours of interlock. Palm rolling take me only three hours. Um, but this is what it looks like. Uh, freshly washed, new glow. So I'm just going to do a temp, do a palm roll. Not gonna be nothing tight. I'm not trying to hold it down. I just want it to just be neat so that my roots don't stick together and marry and I don't have to pop locks, which I hate. So I washed my hair using Giovanni tea tree. Um and the hemp shampoo by Giovanni for to add hydration back to my hair. Um, my conditioner, because I color my hair, I use K Pack for for that um, as a conditioner. That's what I use. My leave-ins that I use are Spitting Magic and. 10 in 1 treatment. And followed by my Bio Silk treatment. So those are my, that's how I wash condition and my treatments. Um, what I'm going to be using the palm roll is going to be my Giovanni. I don't know if you can see that. Giovanni pomade which holds no it says it has fragrance but there is no way there's fragrance in this it doesn't irritate my scalp it's not an overpowering perfume smell it holds it's not sticky once it dries it's not sticky it stays it holds this is the best thing period so what I'm going to do is take my hair and pull it all up. Oh, and by the way, I do have an undercut. This lock, I had to, I had to cut this lock because it got stuck with another lock when I was interlocking. So I cut it off and it's finally grown back. It was actually cut all the way down and it grew and I started interlocking it um but i'm going to pull my hair all the way up there we go and i'm gonna get it girl it is what i'm gonna do all right so then i will go i just go one by one and it's not about it necessarily. The only time I'm worried about my parts really right now is just to keep it maintained. But I get my parts back honestly when, sorry, I get my parts back together when I interlock. So I'm just palm rolling and I just take a little bit of the Giovanni and put it on there and smooth it down. And I just smooth it and move my hairs out the way and I just palm roll it and I put a little bit of this Giovanni down the lock and that's it I 
I'll just pull it to the side. Or I'll just put it behind my ear. And then I'll move on to the next one and do the same thing. If I have some hairs loose, I will take it and just twist it around. And that's it. That's all I'm going to be doing. Um, and like I said, it's just to keep it from, keep my roots from marrying and attaching to each other so that I don't have to pop locks. Again, hate popping locks. I hate the way it sounds. It sounds awful. And I'm just going to keep doing this until my whole head is complete. And once I am done, I will come back and show you what it looks like when it's finished. Which is basically going to look like, you know, what it normally looks like. Neat locks. This is what it's going, that's what it's going to look like. And like I said, the, the pomade I'm using by Giovanni, hands down, I in the very beginning when I locked, I was palm rolling, starting out, and I was using stuff and it just irritated my scalp so bad that I couldn't even last with the palm roll because it was itching so bad. So I would end up washing my hair and then having to do it over again, which basically too much twisting just causes damage. So I decided to start interlocking where I didn't have to use any product at all. Just water, oil, I'm cool. Oh, you know, and the treatments when needed. That's about it. I'm going to finish this up and as soon as I am done I will show you what it looks like when I'm finished hi okay so I'm back um retwist done took me actually only two and a half hours I went kind of quick this time because I didn't take any breaks but this is what it looks like this is what it looks like completed it's not sticky, it's not a loud smell, no fragrance. It's not greasy, but it's moisturizing. It has moisturizers in that um, pomade. So I don't necessarily have to add an oil on my scalp tonight. I can wait maybe a couple of days before I have to oil my scalp. So, but this is it. This is the completed retwist after a fresh wash after a nice fresh wash um undercut it's not done yet my husband went to sleep on me so yeah i'll get it done tomorrow whatever i don't feel like doing it anyway at this point and i don't feel like sitting down and getting it done he fell asleep and i'm cool so but everything came out good. I'm surprised it only took me two and a half hours. This time, instead of three, not that much of a difference, but 30 minutes cut off. So that's good. But it's so soft. It's not hard at all. Like, which is crazy. Because at first I used to use gels and things like that. And it just flaked, itched everything. This does not flake. It don't itch. It's moisturizing. I don't have to oil my scalp right afterwards. 
it's like, it's something I'm going to keep using. Problem is, only downside to that pomade is the jar is so small. I'm going to need them to make that in a big gallon size. Make a big, a big size. Because um, I almost finished that jar. And I was just using a little bit. And I made a serious dent in it. So one more use out of it. And that's it. But I won't be retwisting again for maybe three, four weeks or so. Of course, I'm going to be washing it every week. Because I like my scalp to be clean. I don't do the flaking, itching, none of that. So, weekly washing, retwist, maybe three, four weeks. If I feel like it, could be six weeks. Who knows? But, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. I'm out.